Assalamualaikum to everyone. Today our group will present uh, a new salary structure proposal for the company that we choose. The industry for the company that our group choose is uh, FMB. The company, uh, the, the the name of our company is uh, the Food Heaven. The Food Heaven uh, is a food and beverage species in Kuala Lumpur. It's a culinary gem that showcases the city's culinary heritage and creativity. Located in a, in a historic bakery, the restaurant offers an extraordinary dining experience with a team of chef and foodies creating inventive yet deeply entrenched meals. Uh, the menu includes artisanal cheese, spice, fresh fish and organic produce from nearby farms. The restaurant is uh, dedicated to quality and, cre and cre creativity with a cozy, welcoming ambitions that make customers feel like family members uh, and the teams from var uh, various cul culinary backgrounds is passionate about spreading their love of food. So, uh, and the restaurant has received multiple uh, awards for its excellent service, inventive food, and commitment to sustainability. Okay, next. <clears throat> okay, the first important position that our company need is a general manager. Okay, uh, so this is uh, the job and job description and job certification for this uh, position. Next. Uh, and this one is job evolution. Okay, uh, the, this is uh, the market survey that we use uh, for uh, for uh, the for survey the salary. So uh, we we uh, we sorry we choose uh, three website which is salary expert glassdoor and job street so the position is uh, for the position of general manager our company follows a structured salary policy that aligns with industry standard and the ex the ex expertise required for the rules the average market survey salary annually for this average market salary which is uh, 402888 the reason why we choose this pay decision is because the salary, the salary is suitable for this position. In addition, the employee, the employees must be, must possess uh, at least bachelor in this in business or relevant fields. My master is a plus. Other than that, the employee should have uh, at least knowledge of business process. Okay, next. I will pass to the next presentation. This is Human Resource Department. This is uh, our Human Resource Department. It's a Human Resource Manager, Training Executive, Perfect Executive and Employee Relation. For Human Resource Manager, this is uh, Job Description and Job Specification. Okay, this is Job Evaluation for Human Resource Manager. Okay, this is uh, for market survey human resource manager and uh, human resource manager salary is RM uh, 100 This figure reflects the complexity and strategic importance of human resource management in our organization. Human resource management plays an important role in talent acquisition, employee development and organization culture which require a non set, uh, understanding of workforce dynamic level law and strategic planning. Okay, next is training executive. This is job description and job specification for training executive. Okay, this is a uh, job relation for training executive. Okay, this is market survey for training executive. Uh, so our company decided that the pay of for training executive position is uh, RM seven seven thousand. However, this figure fell short of effectively expressing the strategic importance and interest of HRM inside our organization. Training executive is crucial to the development of talent, the growth of employees, and the culture of the company. Thus, they must be knowledgeable in labor law, workforce dynamic, and strategy planning. 
Okay, move, we move to the recruitment executive. This is the position and just verification for recruitment executive. Project version, this is the position for uh, recruitment executive. Okay, this is our market survey for recruitment executive. And our company decide to provide a salary of RM at 66,000 per year for uh, RM5,533 per month. This decision is due to the strategic importance of this and the role of the requirement executive in ensuring the provision of quality talent for our organization. In an era of intense competition, expertise in requiring and attracting the right talent in order to ensure the continuity and success of an organization. Okay, the last uh, position is employee relation. This is job description and just position for employee relation. Okay, next is job definition. This is job relation for employee relation. Okay, this is market survey and company decided to give a salary of RM84 per year, 84,000 per year, and 7,000 per month. This decide is because we understand the employee relation play an important role. Learning organization needs with the right talent in finding and attracting quality candidate, expertise and experience in is critical by providing compensation and uh, or part with the market average. We reaffirm our commitment to the retention and growth of quality talent. Okay, I pass to the next presenter. Thank you. Okay, uh, next I will explain about financial department. So, under financial department, we have four positions. Financial manager, finance assistant manager, finance officer and accountant. So this is the job description and job specification for financial manager. This is the job evaluation for financial manager. Uh, so this is the market survey and the pay decision. So our company decide to pay the salary for financial manager of 136,886 ringgit. This is due to the fact that financial managers have specific knowledge and expertise in field like investment management, accounting and finance. Besides financial manager also in charge of detecting and reducing any other financial hazard that the business might encounter. So next is the finance assistant manager. This is the job description and job specification. Uh, this is the job evaluation for finance assistant manager. So the market survey for finance assistant manager and the pay decision. So our company decide to pay the salary for financial manager of 72000 This is due to the fact that finance assistant manager uh, frequently deal with routine financial duties such transaction processing, account payable and receivable management, and financial report preparation. Moreover, financial assistant manager frequently act as a conduit for internal talent de development. The third one is finance officer. This is their job description and job specification. So this is the job evaluation. The market survey for uh, finance officer and their pay decision. So our company decide to pay the salary for finance officer of 53,348 uh, because the important part finance officer play in creating financial reports including cash flow, income and balance sheet. Aside from that, finance officer analyze financial data to determine trends, account investment potential and determine profitability. And the last one is accountant. For accountant, this is their job description and also job specification. This is their job evaluation and also market survey. And as for their pay decision, uh, our company decided to pay the salary for the accountant of RM34 ringgit 132. So this is because uh, precise documentation and recording of financial activity inside company are the duties of accountant. Besides, accountant ensure that tax rules and regulation are followed by correctly crafting and timely filing tax return. So next, I'll pass to the next presenter. All right. And this is for operation department. We have operation manager, supervisor operating, project manager, and also customer service. 
Okay, this is uh, the job description and also job specification for operation manager. And this is the job evaluation for operation manager. And for market survey, average salary survey for the operation manager is 274,849 ringgit. Our company decided to pay the price annually for operation manager position. Resumes for operation manager with a wide variety of project management skills, including knowledge of technology, strategic thinking, communication, time management, problem solving, and also organization organizational skills are preferred by employers. Uh, a candidate will be paid more according to the level of ability. Next, we have supervisor operating, and this is the job description and also job specification. And this is the job evaluation for supervisor operating. And for market survey, for supervisor operating position, we adopt a salary structure policy that is in line with industry standards and expertise requirement for the road. Although the average salary for supervisor operating in the market is 53,525 a year, our company has decided to provide the salary of 66 thousand four hundred per year a supervisor makes sure that everything runs well by supervising and organizing the actions of a team for the project manager position we have job description and also job specification and this is job evaluation for the position of project manager and this is the market survey for for a uh, project manager we adopt a structure policy that is in line with industry standards and Expertise requirements for the role, although the average salary for project manager in the market is 108,920 per year, our company has decided to provide salary of uh, that price per year. This is due to the fact that project managers are well organized, have excellent communication, and also leadership qualities. For customer service, uh, this is the job description and also job specification for that position. And this is the job evaluation for that position. And lastly, we have market survey. Uh, for customer service position, we adopt a salary structure policy that is in line with industry standards and expertise requirements for the role. Although the average salary for customer service in the market is 35 ringgit, 35,200 ringgit per year, our company has decided to provide a salary of that price per year. This is due to the fact that customer service can ensure pleasant interactions and client satisfaction. Success in the customer service professions involves a combination of empathy, communication skills, patience, and also problem solving talents. So next is uh, the under marketing department. So marketing department have a uh, four, four position. The first position is marketing manager. Uh, this is a job description and also the justification for this uh, position. And also this is a uh, evaluation um, the that position uh, marketing manager. And uh, for the uh, salary uh, survey, we use three website which is Salary Expert, Glass Auto, and Job um, Job Street. And the uh, average for salary annually for this position is 108560, and also the average salary money in uh, 9,040. And for TC and also the years of working experience is three years. So the our the for base of pay decision, our company calculate the marketing managers by using the salary structure policy and determining a market average of one zero eight five six zero. And the salary is based on their specialist knowledge and experience in marketing manager, which helps the business advance. They also have this the responsibility of understanding the business strategy for controlling the product market. So next position is advertisement. So this is a job description and the job specification for this uh, position. And also this is a evaluation uh, in that position. 
and for the uh, advertisement I will send salary annually is on uh, 69,244 and also the one if uh, 5,770 and the years of work experience is 2 years so uh, the for base a decision of company advertising compensation is based on the salary structure policy with an average salary of 69,244. This is chosen due to the specialist understanding and proficiency in methodologies, including telemarketing and the creative management of items for social media marketing to ensure consumer interest. The next position is a marketing supervisor. So this is uh, the job description and also the job specification for this position. And also this is a uh, evaluation for this position. And for the average salary for this position is um forty nine thousand eight hundred sixty six, and for the money is four thousand one hundred and fifty five. And also the years of working experience in three years. So based on um. Uh, or pay decision our company calculates the marketing supervisor by using the web search based on the market survey the average compensation for marketing supervisor is 49,800 CTC uh, reflecting their specialist knowledge and pro- proficiency in the marketing domain domain this compensation aligns with their business purpose and vision and it can set performance standard to fulfill the role purpose Visions. So the na- the last position ah uh, in the marketing department is marketing and sales coordinator. So this a uh, job description and also the job specification for this position, and also this a uh, evaluation ah uh, for this position, and for this position ah uh, we use every salary annually is forty six thousand one hundred and nineteen. And also the average salary monthly three thousand eight hundred and forty three, and the years of work experience is three years. So based on our pay decision, the organisation use average policy to salary for marketing and sales coordinator based on the market survey. The average income for a marketing and sales coordinator is forty six thousand one hundred and nineteen, which the organisation has determined to pay due to their specialist knowledge and industry process proficiency. They also work. With the company's marketing product de- development team and also ma- maintain customer, so I will like um pass this slide for our uh, next presenter. Last, the last department that we need in this company is logistic department. Ah, uh, so this position, ah, uh, this department is to manage how resources are acquired, store and transport to their final destination. So in this ah uh, department, we have four. For- Four position, which is a uh, sourcing managers, procurement distribution administrator, and the last one is inventory supervisor. Next, okay. The first, the first position is sourcing manage manager. This is uh, the job description and job certification. Next, and this is uh, the job evaluation for the for this position. Next. Okay. Ah, uh, this is a uh, market survey. Ah, uh, and the pay decision. Our company select ah uh, select a pay like company level policy to pay employees salaries and wage, and wages wages. Ah, uh, the average market survey salary annually for this position is one zero one zero seven four hundred. So our company decide to pay a uh, sourcing manager position with the amount of the average market survey salary, which. Is ah one zero one zero seven four hundred. The reason is because the salary is suitable for this position. In addition, the employees must possess at least a a bachelor degree or master degree. Other than that, the employees should have at least strong project management and leadership skills. Next, for the second ah uh, position is ah uh, procurement. This is the job description and the job certification. Okay, this is uh, the job evaluation for this position. Next, and this market survey for a uh, procurement position and the pay decision is our company select uh, a pay like company level policy to 
pay employees series and wage and wages the average market service salary annually for this position is 94,672 ringgit so our company decide to pay the procurement position with the amount of the average market survey so the reason is because the salary is suitable for this position in addition the, the employees must have strong problem sol solving skills other than that uh, strong verbal and uh, written communication skills are, are a requirement for this position next one the third position uh, distribution administrator and this one uh, the job description and job certification for this position and the, this this is uh, the job evaluation for this position next okay uh this is the market survey for for uh, what is it uh, this for this deep distribution administrator so then uh the pay decision is for distribution and administrator position we use salary structure policy to determine uh disposition salaries so we use the salary structure to calculate salaries the average distribution and administrator salary survey in the market is 44,708 after making calculation using the salary structure our company has decided to pay a distribution administrator uh, salary uh, this is because the position has specific knowledge and expertise in the field of distribution in fact the distribution administrator is also responsible responsible for maintaining strong multitasking abilities and excellent negoti negotiation and the and network and networking skills okay for the last position is uh inventory the inventory supervisor and this one uh, the job description and job specification for this position Next. and uh we can as we can see this is the job evaluation for the position next okay this one uh, the last one is uh, market survey and the pay decision uh, for the position of the inventory supervisor, we use uh, pay structure policy to determine the salary for this position. Every salary annually on market survey for an inventory su supervisor is 72,776 ringgit. So, company decide to pay the salary for pay, to pay the salary of the position uh, at the amount uh, state in there. So the reason is because this position is responsible for managing stock levels and uh, distribution of inventory. Other than that, it also ensure uh, accuracy in inventory stock, uh, inventory records. Okay, I will pass to the next presenter. Okay, next this is benefit. This is the insurance benefit and type of insurance is life insurance, health insurance, personal accident insurance business insurance okay the benefit of insurance coverage are important and extensive providing deep insurance for financial security and mental protection to people who put their big investment to work with the health care coverage employees are given access to basic clinical consideration without facing heavy financial pressures focusing on well-being without neglecting financial commitment Okay, next I proceed to the next presenter. So, uh, next uh, is a uh, legally required benefit. So, the benefit the employee or employer get is first is also so, so, which is social security organization contribution and also PF which is employees providing fund contribution and also EIS which is employment insurance system contributions so next uh, the next benefit for our employees is uh, leave benefits so uh, our employees uh, will be uh, will, will give uh, the uh, the benefit is a uh, sick leave uh, public holiday unpaid leave maternity leave and paternity leave that's all for me. Okay, uh, lastly, for other benefits, our company also provides allowance, student loan repayment, college grants and scholarship. For the allowance, we have phone allowance, transportation allowance, food allowance and travel and spending allowance. Next, I will pass to, uh, to the next presenter for conclusion. Okay, for the conclusion, 
The company also emphasizes how important it is to make sure that the salary, com salary is competitive and sufficient to draw in top people and maintain the company's success in a highly competitive environment. This demonstrates how aware the company is of the need to develop and retain top people. That's all from us. Thank you.